Hello everyone and welcome to Bedtime Live on Instagram. Welcome if it is your first time and welcome back if you've been here with me before. My name is Cleo. Once again, welcome to Bedtime Live. I'm very excited to read Good Night Numbers with you guys tonight. But first, let's sing our welcome song. The good evening train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. The good evening train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. The good evening train is coming. The good evening train is coming. The good evening train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. Today, we're going to learn to say good evening in Spanish. Spanish. Spanish is a different language than the language I'm speaking right now to you. We're speaking English right now. We're going to learn to say good evening in Spanish. We say good evening in Spanish by saying buenas noches. Buenas noches. Good evening. Buenas noches. You know, actually there is one country that I know for sure speaks Spanish in Africa, in the continent of Africa. This country over here, which has goats in it, Morocco, has lots of Spanish speakers because it's actually pretty close to Spain, where lots more people speak Spanish. So now we know how to say good evening in Spanish. Buenas noches. Can you try? Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Let's finish our welcome song. And we say buenas noches. Doggy, how are you? Chew, chew. We say buenas noches. Elephant, how are you? Choo choo, we say buenas noches. <gasps> Bear, we say buenas noches. Cleo, we say buenas noches to you. How are you? Choo choo, buenas noches, train is coming. How are you? Choo choo, buenas noches, train is coming. How are you? Choo choo, Buenas noches train is coming, Buenas noches train is coming, Buenas noches train is coming, how are you? Choo choo, yay, well done everybody. Now that we've said welcome, it's about time we make sure we're ready for bed. Some of the things that I do before I go to bed are brush my teeth and put my PJs on. Let's sing a song and make sure that we've checked all our boxes. I'm going to use sign language while I sing. So I'll be moving my hands. Some people that have trouble talking with their mouths or who have trouble hearing use sign language. They sign with their hands. They can say all the things that I'm saying with my mouth with their hands. Let's sing our song. Buenas noches, my friends. Buenas noches. Buenas noches, my friends. Buenas noches. Buenas noches, my friends. Buenas noches, my friends. Buenas noches, my friends. Buenas noches. Did you have a good day today? I did. Did you have a good day today? Did you have a good day? Did you have a good day? Did you have a good day today? Let's ready ourselves for bed. <sighs> Let's ready ourselves for bed. <sighs> let's ready ourselves, let's ready ourselves, let's ready ourselves for bed. Now you can tell me if you've done these things to get ready, you can tell me, yes, Cleo, 
I did do those things. Or no, Cleo, I did not do that thing today. And maybe I don't do that thing ever. Okay, let's think. Did you brush your teeth? I did. I hope you did. Did you drink some water? Maybe. No. Oh, okay. No. All right. Fair. Did you have a bath? Did you eat a snack? Maybe an apple? I don't know. <laughs> Here's tonight's story. Good night, numbers. Good night, numbers. We're going to be practicing our numbers today. Let's get started. Good Night Numbers by Dansa McKellar. Whoa, guys. Look at all these numbers in here. Do you recognize any of these numbers? Hmm. Do you see the number that's how old you are? I see one. Are you one years old? No. Okay, how about two? Maybe three years old? Maybe four? Or maybe not yet. Maybe five years old? Five? I don't know, maybe. So you see all these numbers, and there they are in words, and they mean the same thing. That's the number one, and there's the word one. And look over here in orange, there's one orange square. They're all the same thing. One orange square, the number one in orange, the word one in orange. Can you show me one on your hand? Yeah, one. Just one. Let's skip and try three. I'm tricking you today. There's the number three in blue. There's the word three. And there's one, two, three blue boxes. Can you show me the number three on your hands? I know it's a little tricky, huh? You can show it like this, or in sign language, it's always like this. One, one, two, three, in sign language, three, or three, whichever one's easier for you. Three, let's start our story. Let's start our story. One, good night, one fork, good night, one spoon. Good night, one bowl. I'll see you soon. Hi, Christine. Hi, Christine. Thanks for joining us. You came just in time. We're reading good night numbers. Christine, do you have a favorite number? Can you tell us what your favorite number is? I think my favorite number is 23 because I am 23 years old so it's my favorite number <gasps> two and there's our two the number two and the word two good night two hands good night two feet Good night, two ears, so small and sweet. <gasps> you guys, Christine just told me in the chat that her favorite number is seven. <gasps> I want to make sure Christine sees her favorite number, so we're going to skip in the book to number seven. Seven. Ta-da. There's the number seven. There's the word seven. 
and I wonder what there's seven of in this photo for Christine to enjoy. If you look in the frame, look in that frame. Christine, there's seven yummy strawberries there just for you. Good night, seven days. Oh, because there's seven days in a week. Good night, whole week. Good night, seven teeth. So they clean and they squeak. And look, she's brushing her teeth. They're gonna be so clean. That's something that I said that I did before I went to bed. Yay, seven. All right, let's go back to three. Three. There is our number three. And the word three. And if you look in that frame, are those cookies? There's three cookies for us to eat. Have a bite. Good night. Three wheels. See the tricycle? One, two, three wheels. Good night. Three cars. Three cars in the box. The green car, the blue car, the red car. Good night, all trucks and pots and pans. There's three of each, three, three, three. Oh, look what else they're doing before bed. Yeah, having a bath. It's bath time for this family. We're gonna talk about the number four. There's the number four. There's the word for, and both of those mean four. Can you show me four on your hand? Four, that's right, and we look at our little frame. What are those? Bubbles? Oh, there's one, two, three, four bubbles. Four bubbles in this bath, lucky us. Four. Good night, four paws. Good night, kitty cat. Good night, four froggies on the mat. Hey, what's going on at bath time here? Uh-oh. I see splashing, water's gonna get everywhere. Uh-oh, that's a messy bath. Here we are at five. Good night, five points. Oh, five points on the star. Good night, five points. Good night, little star. Good night. Five splashes! And they go really far. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, someone's all wet. Uh-oh. Rut row. Here we are at six. Christine, we're getting close to your favorite number again. Remember? Five, six, and then seven. Christine's favorite. So we're on six now. Six. Good night, six snaps. Good night, Mr. Peach. Oh, there's Mr. Peach, very cute. Good night, six blocks with six sides each. There's always six sides to a block. We've got six sides. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six blocks. That's a really nice tower, huh? It looks like the dog really likes it. Back at seven. Back at seven. This time, let's try and show it on our hands. One, two, three, four, five. I need another hand. Six, seven. Whoa, we made it back to seven. Good 
night, seven days. Good night, whole week. Good night, seven teeth. So clean that they squeak. Eight. Now we're on eight. What are there eight of in this photo? I'm not even sure. Let's look in our frame. What is in the frame? Bones, yeah, some dog bones maybe. And there's eight of them. Let's be sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight bones. Good night, eight arms. Good night, tall vine. Good night, eight sides on the red stop sign. There's the stop sign. Every stop sign you ever see has eight sides. And a shape with eight sides is called an octagon. It's an octagon shape. Eight sides the stop sign has. Eight, eight, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've made it to nine. I wonder what there's nine of in here. I see a lot of butterflies. Maybe there's nine of them. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine butterflies. I was right. Good guessing, Cleo. Good night, nine butterflies. Good night, nine bars. Oh, bars of the crib. There's nine of them, too. Oh, nice. Good night to the moon and countless stars. Good night, moon. We made it. We made it to the big one, 10. Do you know how to make 10 on your fingers? 10, you need all of your fingers, 10. Or in sign language, 10. You just need your thumb, 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. In sign language. Here we go, 10. There's our number 10, there's our word 10. And there's 10 things in the frame. Good night, 10 fingers. Good night, 10 toes. Good night to the world. And everyone knows numbers are around us like really good friends. Good night to all the numbers. Good night. And the end. The end. The end. The end. There are the rest of our numbers. We counted to five. And now we can see six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ta da! Good night, numbers. That was some amazing counting, everybody. That was some amazing counting. I'm really glad your favorite number is seven, Christine. Now that we're finished our story, you know what time it is. Get settled in your bed, get comfy and cozy. I'm just gonna turn my light off so I can focus better and rest my body and rest my brain better. So I'm gonna turn my light off. You can turn yours off too. And we're gonna practice some flower breathing today. To do flower breathing, Think about when you see a flower outside, don't you wanna just smell what it smells like? Especially if I see a rose or maybe some lavender, I just wanna sniff it. So I take a deep breath in through my nose, I go <sighs> and I sigh it out. Let's try again, let's sniff our flowers. Delicious, not delicious, smells great. 
Let's try one more big deep breath. I see a bunch of flowers and I wanna make sure I smell every single one. You do. In through your nose. And sigh it out. <sighs> oh, I think I see a yellow flower with blue stripes. I wanna know what that smells like. Maybe it smells like pizza. Let's have a smell. <sighs> if we do one more big breath, I'm sure our Spanish lullaby is gonna start, okay? Let's try. <sighs> When the Sleepy Man Comes by Charles G.D. Roberts. When the sleepy man comes with dust on his eyes, he shuts up the earth and he opens the skies. He smiles through his fingers and shuts up the sun. The stars that he loves he lets out one by one. The sleepy man comes from the castles of drowsy boy town. At the touch of his hand, tired eyelids fall down. He comes with a murmur of dream in his wings. 
and whispers of mermaids and wonderful things. Then the top is a burden, the bugle a bane, when one would be faring down dream away lane. When one would be wending and lullaby wary to sleepy man's castle, right by comforting fairy. When the sleepy man comes with dust on his eyes, he shuts up the earth and he opens the skies. Good night, everyone. Buenas noches and have a good sleep. Bye-bye. See you next time.